the set of tools for business diagnos diagnosis deals with the productivity of uh, key resources the oldest of them of world war 2 vintage measures the productivity of manual labor now we are slowly developing measurements though still quite primitive ones for the productivity of knowledge based and service work however measuring only the productivity of workers whether blue or white collar no longer gives us adequate information about productivity we need data on total factor productivity that explains the growing popularity of economic value added analysis economic value added analysis is based on something we have known for a long time that is what we generally call profits the money left to service equity is uh, usually not profit at all until a business returns a profit that is greater than its uh, cost of capital it operates at a loss never mind that it pays taxes as if it had a genuine profit the enterprise still returns less to the economy than it devours in resources it does not cover its full costs only the unless the reported profit exceeds the cost of capital until then it does not create wealth that it it destroys it by that measurement incidentally few businesses have been profitable since world war 2 by measuring the value added overall costs including the cost of capital a value um, economic value added analysis measures in effect the productivity of all factors of production it does not by itself tell us why a certain product or a certain service does not add value or what to do about it but it shows us the uh, what we need to find uh, and whether we need to take remedial action economic value added analysis uh, should also be used to find out what works it does show which product service operation or activity has you unusually high productivity and adds unusually high value then we should ask ourselves what can we learn from those successes the most recent of the tools used to obtain productivity information is benchmarking that is comparing one's performance with the best performance in the industry or better yet with the best anywhere in business benchmarking assumes correctly that what the organization does any other organization can do as well and it assumes also correctly that being at least as good as the leader is prerequisite to being competitive together economic value added analysis and the benchmarking provide the diagnostic tools to measure total factor productivity and to manage it my website is up and running and can be logged at www.asifjme.com have a look i also ask you to visit my blog at uh, asifjme.wordpress.com god bless you